Welcome, today we've got the uh, Mead Instrument 60mm Zoom Spotting Scope. Uh, this was picked up from Costco down here in Down Under Australia um, for about 60 to $70 I think. Um, anyway, it was so cheap that you sort of have to get it and have a go. So this is a quick unboxing, there's the uh, the specs. We've got, uh, it says 20 to 60 times. Uh, Ob objective lens diameter 60 millimeters, fully coated, fi uh, coated. Field of view 115 feet at 1,000 yards, uh, or 38.4 meters at 1,000 meters, um, and that's on 20, 20 times. Now I have had a quick look at this, and it, I'm not sure it does a full 60 times, and it does get dark, um, but we'll get onto that later. All right, and then it comes with this case. Pupil diameter is three millimeters at 20 times. Uh, dimensions, uh, weight, it is uh, 795 grams. Comes uh, with a whole bunch of stuff we're about to see. So let's crack it open and have a look. <coughs> that. Just packaging. Uh, the case uh, is, it's like a rip off of a uh, Pelican case. Uh, okay job I like my pelican case and cases more uh, but for seventy dollars who can complain first up you've got your instruction manual introduction on how to use it saying never use at the sun uh, point at the sun or your bits and pieces uh, how to mount it uh, cleaning and maintenance product registration forms uh, I never fill this in that's just me Right, now we get down to the nitty gritty. We've got the tripod and we've got the um, spotting scope itself. Now, I've had a quick play of this with this tripod, uh, the one in the store actually, and frankly, it's a piece of shh doo doo. I'll say doo doo. Be the polite way of um, describing this tripod. It's just a rickety, flimsy piece of junk. When, it, when it's out, that is, you can see the play in that piece of junk. Maybe, maybe, um, down on three legs like that, on the ground, like that, let's see if I can do it, uh, while you're lying down prone, but I wouldn't extend it, and I wouldn't trust it. Alright, so that's the uh, tripod. Now we have the spotting scope itself, and there's a uh, cleaning, cleaning cloth. Alright, Comes in a bit of plastic. All right, crack the uh, scope out. Uh, construction feels like a decent construction. Well, for seventy dollars, it's a very good construction. Um, made in China, as you'd expect, and it says it's water resistant. Uh, Twenty to sixty times magnification. Uh, lens cap got a little compass in there. Um, yep. And then you pull that off there to see your your uh, your eyepiece and your zoom. You can zoom it up to 60 apparently. Now I have used this out in the field very briefly. So my initial impressions of it are: it's a great uh, scope to get for 60 to 70 dollars Australian. Um, when you on 20 times, uh, you got a very nice clear image. Uh, when you start zooming in, like a lot of cheap optics, it starts. Um, dimming, the light unit real, real dims down, um, and you get a little bit of colour fringing but not as bad as, not as bad as other cheap scopes and things out there. And when I say colour fringing, it's sort of like a prism, prism on the edge of the uh, lens. So that's the, uh, my quick look at and, and initial impressions of the Mead 20 to 60 uh, spotting scope. Would I recommend buying it? Uh, so far, yes. We'll see, uh, we'll see how it goes in the field, because uh, that will be the true test. And if you want, want me to come back and uh, show you guys that, then uh, give us a heads up and I'll, I'll make a video of that. Alright, stay safe guys.